After record wildfires ravaged parts of Spain, replanting trees amid the apocalyptic ash-covered landscape is a daunting task. Experts are finding new ways to avert forest fires using drone technology. This seed-dropping drone is spreading different species of plants and trees across a plateau in the semi-arid Altiplano steppe among the Grenada, Almeria and Murcia regions. Experts believe hundreds of years ago these lands were probably covered by savine, home oak and juniper trees. But they may have been eliminated by humans. Now, after centuries of agricultural, mostly cereal and olive groves, and livestock activity under Lucia's government and non-governmental organization Al Vilal is hoping to restore one million hectares of landscape. We have a very ambitious program to recover the forest vegetation that we believe covered all this forest area, a landscape that has been degraded in a secular way by disorderly use for livestock, wood, grass, etc. The ambitious Green Belt project was launched in 2015 and could take until at least 2035. The degradation of many centuries cannot be reversed in just 20 years. But experts believe the first changes could be seen in a few decades. The reforestation of the Andalusia region is difficult and expensive. Conservationists must either use big machines to open furrows in the land in order to get the water to penetrate, which in turn destroys existing vegetation, or they have to water for years or provide nutrients in the soil. That's why this project is carrying out landscape restoration based on both plantations and sowing techniques. Over two days, about 500,000 seeds were dropped from this drone over just 50 hectares of land. As benefits, we would have an increase in plant biodiversity. By increasing plant biodiversity, we increase trophic resources for an infinity of animals. Therefore, we will also increase animal biodiversity. We would also increase resilience or their ability to adapt to changing conditions that climate change will bring in the coming years. To be able to help nature to take that step a little faster, by bringing seeds that are far, by putting them close, by bringing the plants that would bloom here by themselves, we come ahead of 100, 200 years of what nature alone would end up doing. But it is better if it happens now, isn't it? A 2016 study published in the Jano Science predicted southern Spain would become desert and deciduous forests would vanish from much of the Mediterranean basin unless global warming is reined in sharply. Researchers said under the most extreme scenario in which global warming hits 2 degrees, deserts would expand in Spain, North Africa and the Near East. While vegetation in the region would undergo a significant change from the coasts right up to the mountains. Bureau report, we are World is One. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.